Aesthetics is related to sense perception, to the experience of appreciating the effects of artworks, designs, natural environments and other phenomena. The term aesthetic is often used in relation to artistic work and creativity. It's a very old and ancient word, dating back to the writings of Aristotle and Plato, so it has a long history. Therefore it's not surprising that there are many different interpretations of it. There are two particular meanings which we will consider here. One is to understand aesthetics as an important aspect of human experience. Aesthetic appreciation relates to our sensory or emotional responses that guide our preferences and lead to judgments of beauty or value. Typically, aesthetic judgments are made about the artistic value of a particular work, the quality of a particular experience, or the elegance of a particular solution or design. As creative practitioners, we want to provide users and audiences with a positive aesthetic experience. We want to structure things to induce that experience. A second meaning of aesthetics is as a way to describe the properties of an artifact. Especially in the fields of creative arts and design, but also in natural environments and even in the features of a scientific discovery. It's common to say, for example, there is a need to pay attention to the aesthetics of that design, by which it's meant more attention to the elegance or refinement of the design is required. Used in this way, aesthetic judgment refers to the sensory contemplation or appreciation of an artifact based on its properties. Such aesthetic judgments usually go beyond sensory discrimination, not merely an intuitive feeling, but a consideration that involves intellectual calculation about how interesting, unique, beautiful or well-crafted something is. We regularly employ aesthetic judgments in our creative activities as we make judgments about the suitability or quality of our own work and the work of others. Therefore, aesthetic judgments provide internal feedback that drive our design and our creativity forward. Our work will also be judged by others in a similar way. Therefore, it's useful to become familiar with the aesthetic standards and preferences of the field, discipline and practice in which we're working. If we are successful in being sensitive to the aesthetic properties of those things that we create, they're much more likely to be judged valuable by others, not just now, but into the future.